You're watching KOAT Action 7 News. The money Albuquerque will lose from Balloon Fiesta and other events is severe. It's enough to pay for 40 cops, their cars, and their gear. Well, Target 7 has learned the city has a pot of money that could help. The only problem is they can't touch it. Albuquerque got money from the CARES Act. We still have $150 million in the bank from the feds that we can't use because of the rules Congress put on that money. Those dollars given to cities can only be spent on things directly related to coronavirus, but the city wants to use the money to get itself out of a $100 million budget deficit. And it really needs the money now because balloon fiesta revenue accounts for about $4 million in sales tax money that comes from tourists coming to town. We had estimated that the balloon fiesta event would be scaled back a bit, um, but we didn't have it that it was canceled. The city finance director said she believes the CARES money can be used to pay for first responders, but in an interview with Target 7, Congresswoman Deb Holland said before the city can use that money, the Senate needs to approve something else, the HEROES Act, which would give cities more liberty on how to use the money from the CARES Act. So basically the HEROES Act was introduced to fix problems with the other legislation. We want the cities to be able to spend the money on uh, on these salaries, on anything, quite frankly, um, that they need to, uh, that would meet that budget shortfall. The HEROES Act was approved by the House. It has not been called for a vote yet in the Senate by Majority Leader Mitch McConnell. If they don't pass the HEROES Act, it's going to be very difficult for cities like Albuquerque. Uh, you know, firefighters won't get paid. First responders won't get paid. We won't be able to fix potholes. I mean, uh, add, add things to the list. Well, the city has not said what it will do if the HEROES Act does not pass. Former British Prime Minister David Cameron.